What's up, Fisher fam? Back here for the week two results. Uh, gonna run through them really quick. Uh, starting off with yours truly, Naughty Nashville beat Illinois Outlaw. Chi Chi uh, 167 to 111. Absolutely whooped her. Had uh, Jalen Hurts go off and Amonra St. Brown go off. So uh, pretty big stud performances there. Next is Indy Ballers beat Sons of Ditka. This was a very close one, 160 to 150. Uh, Josh Allen continues to dominate for Indy Ballers. Um, and even a crazy performance from Tyreek Hill and Nick Chubb couldn't get the job done for Sons of Ditka. So commiserations for you, John. The uh, Bears lost again to Gangsta CC. The Bears only mustered up 90 points. So, Steve, you're going to have to figure something out. Good performance for uh, Chelsea uh, with 108. Uh, Joe Burrow has not uh, done it for you yet. So, hopefully, he turns it around for you. Uncle Lee's Rage to Rage, a million quarterbacks, uh, lost to uh, son-in-law Jesus, Steph's husband, uh, as his uh, team name has changed, uh, 107 to 136. Uh, again, Jesus has uh, Stefan Diggs and just absolutely dominating for him. Um, so good on you there. And Lee, I guess you picked the wrong quarterback this week. Brad's house beat Gateway City Super Hornets 111 to 77. Uh, Gateway City Super Hornets, uh, very, very, very poor performance. Brad's house got away with one. And then the last matchup was the grudge match. The household beat down Dr. J, beat the Guru 175 to 154. Crazy performance from Lamar Jackson with 69 points. Um, the Guru had a very good performance as well with 154, so tough luck there, Guru. Better days ahead. Those were the week two results. Um, so there's only a few teams left that are 2-0. and oh. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> uh, if you're 0-2, you really need to start scrapping together some wins if you want to make the playoffs. 1-1, one and one, obviously, you're, you're still in the hunt. But, uh, you know, we're, we're, we're hitting the stride of the season and uh, teams are going to start figuring it out. So, um, And then Fisher Fam Thanksgiving will be here before you know it. So all the trash talking, right? Mm-hmm. Right, right. Okay. Uh, okay, now we're going to do, like, Top Gun Team of the Week, but uh, a few other awards. And Kels is going to read those out for us. Uh, so, Kels, if you want to go ahead. And now it's time for awards from week two. Top Gun. Bow, bow, bow. Evil, the Dr. J, led the league this week with an impressive 175 points. Yep, Look at it. very it. good. I called that. I said... Go underdog and go he did. Team of the week, W-E-A-K. Not so great for Gateway City Super Hornets, who was left in the dust with a lowly 77 points. Uh, but bragging rights, all Naughty Nashville. Good job. Naughty Nashville has the bragging rights because he blew out Illinois Outlaw by 56 points. So that was a 167 points to 111 points. And then the bad luck award is Sons of Dicka because he had a painful week losing to Indy Ballers by just 10 points. So that was close and that hurts to see. The not so lucky award. <laughs> Wait, we have a bad luck award and a not so lucky award. I love this. <laughs> Everyone's just not so lucky. Uh, the guru players beat Dr. J's eight to three, but still ended up taking the L thanks to a bonkers game from Lamar Jackson. <laughs> Lamar Jackson is he a Kardashian dude? Uh, no, that's uh, the other Lamar. Yeah, other Lamar. Defense wins championships. Award, Indy Ballers focused on all three phases of the game this week, getting a huge 20 points from the Buffalo Bills DST to propel them to victory. The 85 Bears would be proud of you. Wow, big fact, big fact. Big fact. Look at me. All right, those are the uh, week two awards. And I think Kelsey has a, uh, a, a, a final quote to take us out. Yeah, boom, boom, boom. Football quote of the week. Winners never quit and quitters never win. Thank you, Vince Lombardi. Boom, boom, boom. Vince Lombardi, everybody. 
The GOAT. Uh, oh, let's do uh, power rankings real quick, too. Okay, updated power rankings. Do you want to read Lowest these? Lowest to highest, yeah, right? Yeah, let me read these? Yeah, you, uh, you go and then I'll go one. Oh, all right, all right. Okay, power rankings for week three, going into week three. Uh, at the bottom is Brad's house. Uh, just not able to get it done. Um, has really poor uh, running back play. Just your starters don't have enough, so you're going to have to figure something out, this Brad. This is so mean. So mean. This okay. is so mean. All I right. like it. Number 11. I love that his name changes every week. Number 11, Steph's husband. <laughs> love it, Jesus. Um, number 10, the Bears, co-commish Steve. Uh, really, really good wide receivers. Uh, really, really bad running backs. So, um, just like everybody. Hey, there's one team in the league that has a bunch of really good running backs. So, uh, if you know that team is sending you any trades that you might want to take a look at is that you it's me oh uh yeah uh, um please respond to my trades everybody or accept <laughs> them because they're great trades okay here we go number nine number nine gateway city super hornets awesome k rb yep uh <laughs> number eight illinois outlaw um yeah, good running back play, just not a whole lot of uh, anything else. Number seven, a team quarterback. Team quarterback, Uncle Lee's Rage to Rage, but mm -hmm. still not even in the top 50%. Ooh. Mm -hmm. Here we go. Now we're in the top six of the league, Ooh. power rankings. Yeah, yeah. Number six, this week's uh, or week two's Top Gun, Evil the Dr. J. Number five, Indie Ballers. Number four, Sons of Ditka, uh, who I am going up against in week three. So that'll be a tough matchup. Number three, we're in our top three. Number three, Gangsta CC. Chelsea coming in hot at number wow. three. Look at all those green rankings. I know. She's really, really good. good. It's those tight ends. Frankie is being vocal during our I podcast. Know. It's She's so sweet. Number two, the guru coming in at number two at one and one. Uh, yeah, he just pulled off a crazy trade uh, with Evil the Dr. J. I am a little uh, bummed at this trade. I think it's a huge uh, win for the guru, so there might be a little bit of collusion going on. And then coming in at number one for the second week in a row, oh, they're going to run away with the league again. Back-to-back -back champs. Give it's, me two belts. Okay. Champ, champ. Champ, champ. <laughs> Little Conor McGregor. We got a naughty Nashville coming in for power rankings number one. Look at all that green and blue. Mm -hmm, Looking good. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay. Thank okay. you. <laughs> that, that, that's it. That's the, uh, that's the power rankings uh, for week two, heading into week three. Um, okay. Should be a good week ahead. Uh, we have for week three matchups, Sons of Dicka versus Naughty Nashville. Gangsta CC versus Indie Ballers. The Bears versus Illinois Outlaw. That would be a good matchup. Steph's Husband versus Gateway City Super Hornets. Uh, the Guru versus Uncle Lee's Rage to Rage. Evil the Dr. J versus Brad's House. Um, okay, hope everyone had a good week. And uh, we'll talk to you soon.